Alright, and we're back with another episode of Ocarina of Time. Before we get started, let's go ahead and grab ourselves a heart. This is my second take on this. And I gotta be sure to lower the volume on this game considerably low. Or it's just not gonna work for some reason. Now, I know I've already made episode 6. 4 and 5 didn't really work out so well because it had matched content, so I had to lower the volume some more. So, without further ado, let's defeat this little old hag. Queen Goma. Parasitic Armored Arch... Okay, Goma. Now, this is where... These things will come in great handy. Those deco nuts I was talking about earlier. This is where they come in great handiness. Except for when he's on the ceiling, you have to use the pellets. And such, and so on and so forth. I like that the room was dark. Was, it wasn't dark when I first came in here, you know what I mean? But that's just me. Well, I gotta say that was the easiest boss in the entire game. Yeah, I'd definitely say so. That's for sure. Yeah, definitely. But in any event... Let's grab this heart, shall we? Now, I'm gonna make sure I have 40 rupees for that one upgrade. If that's alright with you, that is, anyway. I think those will just give me hearts, so... Alright, let's head on out, shall we? Well done, Link. Thou hast verily demonstrated thy courage. I knew that thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now I have yet it more to tell ye. Wouldst thou listen? Yes, I will. Now listen carefully, a wicked man of the desert cast this dreadful curse upon me. This evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorceress powers in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hyrule. For it is in that sacred realm that one will find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. Before time began, before spirits and life existed, Three golden goddesses descended upon this chaos, the chaos that is, was Hyrule. Din, the goddess of power. Nehru, the goddess of wisdom. Forori, the goddess of courage. Din. With her strong flaming arms, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Nehru poured her wisdom onto the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world.
Furore, with her rich soil, produced all life forms who would uphold the law. The three great goddesses, their labors completed, departed for the heavens, and golden sacred triangles remained at the point where the goddesses left the world. Since then, the sacred triangles have become the basis of our world's providence, and the resting place of the triangles has become the sacred realm. I actually managed to read all that. Thou must never allow the desert man in black armor to lay his hands on the sacred Triforce. Thou must never suffer that man with his evil heart to enter the sacred realm of legend. That evil man who cast the death curse upon me and sapped my power. Because of that curse, my end is nigh. Though your valiant efforts to break the curse were successful. I was doomed before you started. Yes, I will pass away soon, but do not grieve for me. I have been able to tell you of these important matters. This is Hyrule's final hope. Link, go now to Hyrule Castle. There, though, we'll surely meet the Princess of Destiny. Take the stone with you, the stone that man wanted so much that he cast the curse on me. I smell smelly socks for some reason. You got the Kokiri Emerald. This is the spiritual stone of the forest, now entrusted to you by the great Deku Tree. The future depends upon thee, Link. Thou art courageous and... Navi the Fairy, help Link to carry out my will. I entreat ye, Navi, good bye. Let's go to Hyrule. Wait, sorry. Let's go to Hyrule Castle Link. Hey, Link, what did you do? The great Deku Tree, did he die? How could you do a thing like that? It's all your fault. I know it is. Not like I can do anything about it, though. He died, he died. Alright. Alright, let me just turn down the volume a little bit more. I honestly can't anymore. It's just not possible. It's just not possible to turn it down anymore. It's on four. Simply is not possible. Sorry about the wait, guys. It's just I'm trying to get this. Okay, you know what? Forget it. All right. Now the first thing I want to do is 
Oh yeah, get some rupees. So let's just hop across those stones real fast to get five more extra. All right. Okay. Let's head on up here. Because there's a few things I want to do before I head out. Okay. I really hate this game. I mean, I love this game. It's just damn copyright shit. Guys, I am recording this myself. So fuck off. And leave me the hell alone, bitches. I gotta aim it right. I'm really pissed about this. Yeah, don't fucking piss me off, people. I'm recording this goddamn thing myself, and I'm trying to lower the volume as best I possibly can, I'm, but I will not mute it. Cool, you're great. You scored three perfect bullseyes. I have to give a neat present. To such a wonderful person. Please take it. You got a Deku Seeds bullet bag. This bag can hold up to 40 slingshot pellet. Yes, I am aware of this. Alright. Now there's another upgrade I want to get before I end off this episode, so... Oh, just left the place. All right. No, I don't want to go up there. It's all YouTube's fault why he's YouTube's messing up my videos. Fucking too many goddamn rules. Can't just fucking upload a video of my own my own choosing anymore. Come on, give me some. As you can see, I'm quite upset with it, yeah. I surrender. To make your quest easier, I can enable you to pick up more Deku sticks, but it'll cost you 40 rupees. Yes, I will buy them. Thank you. Now I can carry twice as many Deku sticks. You know, 10 more. I don't want your money. Alright, well... That's it for this episode. If you've enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like and thanks for watching.